Okay. Hi, my name is Mark Lies again. I am uh, I head up Insights for the whole of Africa in the Indian Ocean Islands, um, and I represent a company by the name of Connemara. Uh, interesting story. When we purchased Insights uh, Africa, the license to operate it in Africa last year, Connemara always traditionally used Insights on its leadership programs, and we found it to be a hugely successful tool to assist people with personal awareness. When Insights came up for sale last year, it was only a logical decision to purchase uh, the rights to distribute this product. And we've only had success being involved in it since last year. So we're very happy that it delivers what, what it needs to deliver to the organization. And we certainly hope it will grow in leaps and bounds throughout the continent of Africa. I think the, the, the real model of where we want to work and where we want to be known to work is improving effectivenesses. And there are five effectivenesses that we look to improve. Obviously, the first thing is individual effectiveness. If you don't know who you are, how do you actually interact with other people? The next one is team effectivenesses, where how do you interact as a human being with your fellow team members? Third one being sales effectiveness. How do you use the skills that you've learned in insights to recognize type in the person you're selling to and learn to adapt and connect with them better? The fourth one being leadership development and leadership effectiveness. How do you use your preferences and your capabilities in terms of leading in an organization? And the last, but not most, probably one of the most important, is the fact that we uh, look at organizational effectiveness. What is the culture of your organization currently? Where do you actually want to be in terms of your vision and values? And how do you get there in terms of the behaviors you exhibit? Uh, we find that that really helps organizations because it's not about teaching the skill inside the organization, it's really about attracting the right people who exhibit the same behaviors as your organization. I think the great thing about insights is right from the beginning it gives you how the individual ticks. So in our discovery profile you can see how an individual ticks based on preference. As opposed to the navigator uh, profile, you can see how the person adapts due to capability. So it gives you a great starting point, and also what it does is it gives you a great starting measure and a benchmark to compare at later times once interventions have been completed. Uh, additionally to that, it adds uh, impact into where you need to address the issues and what are the key issues in the organization that need to be addressed. High performance organizations, for example, need trust. And so often organizations think they have trust, but they don't really. And it's a great measure and a great starting point to introduce that going forward. Oh, I think we've had such fantastic stories. You know, one thing we've tried to move away from really is to be a profile business. Traditionally, Insights was seen as a profile business. We know now in the industry as a solution-based business. So what we like to do is look at the needs of the business and introduce our product to assist with that. We've had great interventions with uh, BP, uh, we've had great interventions with Woolworths, we're cu currently working on an exciting project with a big bank here called Nedbank. Uh, so we really spread the industry quite wide and what you find is once you introduce it into a business it just rolls like fire. You know really it does. It. The guys get so keen, it creates a real non-conflict language inside a business and people to see the effectiveness and see the value in just their day-to-day -day interactions with one another. Oh, we're really excited about the opportunity. You know, we got to meet Victor this week and he's just improved, he's just proved to be such quality. And we're really excited about really addressing the diversity issues in Nigeria and potentially using insights to address those. You know, there are plenty of large-scale organizations there where if you improve organizational effectiveness those, those com com companies could be hugely successful. So we're really excited. We've, we've had, a, had an opportunity to, to meet and greet and, and, and really entertain Victor while he's been here and he's proved to be I think what we call a, a massive asset. He's our first uh, sort of go into West Africa and we, we're hugely excited at the opportunity and we, we're fully behind him, we fully back him we fully support him and we, 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 we're excited with developments that can happen in the future. Oh, definitely so. I think just the awareness of who one is and who their spouse is or family members are 
really assists with connecting with those people. I think the fundamental for me of Insights Discovery is adapting and connecting with people, whether it's in your work environment, whether it's in your personal life, whether it's in your social circle. I really think knowing what makes people tick really makes it easier to get on with them going forward. Oh, we're hugely excited. I think there's, Africa is, 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 the, is the continent of opportunity and the con continent of growth and we want to be part of that. We want to, to help Africa grow, realize its potential. And we've seen how Insights works in South Africa. We've seen how Insights works in, in the SADC areas. We've seen how it works globally. And we're just really excited about really getting involved in Africa and making it work.